the Cubs unveiled their new mascot. His name is Clark. He's this not is, wearing pants. This is we great. have a picture of him, and then we're going to get into Deadspin's piece. Hang on, before we even get to that, just so we could roll right through him, Mike. Director Mike, behind the scenes, helping us out once again. Clark the Cub was unveiled by the Cubs. Deadspin then put out a piece saying, hey, let's do not safe for work stuff with Clark the mascot so we can make fun of the Cubs, which was awesome. So first, we have the original, so Clark the Cub. Uh, not wearing pants, has the jersey on. So you know what? Oh, okay, whatever. He, he looks hip, I guess. You know, he's got a baseball. At least they have the right sport. He's got a bat, too. Cool. Backwards hat. Fun. Loving, I suppose. And then Deadspin asked their readers to send in a bunch of stuff. So there's the first one. Um, and I'm sorry I didn't credit all of them. <laughs> there's obviously Rob Ford from uh, Toronto. <laughs> uh, How to Catch a Predator, of course. All right, continue. Miley Cyrus getting in there, and you can see a little uh, schlong on Clark the Cub. All right, moving along, and there's more schlong. Fantastic. <laughs> Deadspin readers, that's some of the most. So good. Is that it? Oh, that's it. Deadspin <laughs> readers. Uh, <laughs> thank goodness. Some of the some of the best readers of all time. Jesus, true. <laughs> so so uh, funny to me. I'm uh, like, did you guys get the same feeling when you saw Clark the Cub at first? What? When I saw him, like, when you did saw I want to draw a dick on him? When you saw him not wearing <laughs> pants. <laughs> when you saw him not wearing pants. I mean, I think it's, I mean, I don't really, you don't really think about it. It's just a bear. Like, I yeah, feel like it's good for marketing, yeah. But then when I saw, but when I saw the meat and potatoes, <laughs> <laughs> I, I really just busted out laughing. I'm like, this is classic. And, I, and they aired it on, like, a certain network. Yeah, they, yeah, they, on like they, they on Comcast, Comcast yeah. and, the, and, the, and the one of the, the host <laughs> oh, okay. busted out laughing. It was so funny. <laughs> I mean, it's classic, but I mean, I, I don't see a problem with it. I don't know why people don't. I mean, well, here's the thing: the Cubs responded. And, yeah, they, they and they and they basically gave a quote like, "No, we're not changing it." Like you didn't have to say that. <laughs> you didn't have to come out and say anything. Like the, look at their deadspin readers. Like we're internet people. Like yeah. you don't have to respond to yeah, us. Yeah, yeah. So they're making made a bigger deal out of out of it's nothing. It's a pretty appears. ridiculous situation. Yeah, it's a totally I mean, like, what ridiculous. What the fuck's the problem? Like, a comes. I mean, so I half the look, probably, half I the the don't fan. wear pants. Like, what is the difference? What's the problem? Yeah, does the Philly fanatic? I was wear pants? I was thinking, does Philly fanatic wear pants? I don't think he does. I don't think he does either. That, I feel like kids will love the little bear. Like, yeah, whatever. Marketing yeah. thing. So, yeah. but the funny thing was just he's the, probably not even going to be a games. It's probably just a thing to have. Like, no, to send it'll be a game. The, Frank, exactly. the Frank and Beans picture was just the fact that it was just hilarious. Yeah, that's yeah. Really yeah. Funny. Yeah. Yeah. Could you say that was the tip? Of the iceberg. There you go. Yeah. Oh. oh my god. That's why <laughs> you're right, a so, uh, very quickly, I don't understand why the Cubs have to have a mascot. We ha like we, they haven't had one for a long, long time. It doesn't really matter at all. Dude, they haven't had people showing up. Their merchandise sells, man. You don't need it. You merch. don't need it. But you can get. I mean, why do you think the Washington Bullets changed to the Washington Wizards? Because it's just oh, that that's a whole but, different. But I'm story. just saying, like. Yeah. More the kid, kids will, friend kids, got how many, shot. How many yeah. kids would love to have a little cub bear with the Cubs hat? It's also talking about people don't go to the, aren't going to Cubs games, you know. So now you got the oh, thank God. Thing. Yeah, <laughs> need change. So there I mean, it's, put I your foot down. I feel like it's just, they're trying to make more money. Yeah, by, uh, they're, they're trying to make more money by having a mascot. Yeah. Oh, man, I I don't know. I, Why I, not? What would you suggest they do? Yeah. Don't have a mascot. <laughs> That's my suggestion. Just keep like, on look, being the Cubs. Look, they've stayed afloat all this time. I used to have, like, my dad bought me this fucking Beanie Baby thing of, like, a cub. And, and there was and, no mascot before. But you ha And you have it still probably, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's back in Chicago. So there you go. Of course. All of a sudden, the dad's going to buy it. I keep all my collectibles. I'm just, I'm just saying. I'm, You're just... A Chicago win. I don't yeah. understand why they had to do it. The timing is perfect, by the way. Baseball yeah. offseason, the Cubs. Uh, the, the, the Cubs are in the offseason, but the Bulls suck. Yeah. The Blackhawks are good, but I mean, people in Chicago. A lot of people in Chicago pay attention to the Blackhawks. But I'm just saying, yeah. whenever there's Cubs news, people are going to look at it yeah. and they're going to see it. Yeah. So the timing was perfect, obviously, like for all they're this. They're going to make money off it. So it's why not? Such a funny story, man. Well, I, I love Deadspin. <laughs> Kudos to Deadspin and their readers. That was awesome. That was fantastic.